They say what's happening, homeboy? The TIP man, the King Good. Let you know you're checking out hotnewhiphop.com with Baker. What's good, everybody? It's your boy Baker with hotnewhiphop.com. Look, not only is he successful in music, but from the clothes to the movies to his own label to his whole family being on the TV show. Tip, what's going on, man? What's going on, bro? How you doing? I'm good. All right, cool. Welcome back to DC. You've been here quite a couple times, right? Yeah, we rip and run back and forth through here, man, throughout the year. Right. So right now we in DTLI right. doing an install before yeah. your show at the Fillmore tonight. Right. And all right, so recently you already know that the Oscar knobs were out. I got a chance to check out Straight Outta Compton. Dope. And it was a dope movie. Of dope. course, they was nominated for original screenplay. So how do okay. you feel about that? I mean, I think that they deserve to be recognized amongst the, the most uh, decorated films of the year. And I think they should be, like, uh, alongside in competition with the best films of the year because I course. think they were definitely one of them. Of course. Yeah, I learned a lot from that, and especially since right it was, like, one of the highest gross movies of the year. Right on. I mean, well, you know what I'm saying? I, I think, uh, like, commercial success, I don't think has much to do with the Academy and who they consider. Uh, however, I do think that just relevance, like, uh, impacting pop culture and uh, and even just, you know, the the quality of the material and the way it was put together and the significance that 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 story had to an entire generation I exactly kind of like makes it a no-brainer to me exactly so i know last year you introduced bankroll mafia so yeah. what's up with bankroll mafia right now man bank, we just put out a record called out my face man uh myself uh, shout to God, Young Thug, London J. Um, and it is on How New Hip Hop. Yeah, right now. Appreciate y'all, man. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, and and we working on the uh, the entire uh, Bank Road Mafia project. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, look, going back to movies, you got up and coming movie projects coming out. Uh -huh. I know you in Sleepless Nights with Jamie Foxx and yeah. Gabrielle Union. And as well, you in the remake of The Roots. <laughs> yeah, I'm in the remake of Roots as well. So the 40th anniversary, the 40th anniversary coming up in 17. Oh yeah, and uh, that's when it's coming out. So what more can you tell us about the movies? Well, yeah. Roots is uh, it's it's a, a a remake of the original, and it, 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 it the 40th anniversary is in February of 2017. That's when you can expect to see it. Right, and it should be simulcasted uh, on uh, the biography, Discovery, and. Uh, a few more. It's like five or six, you know, very, 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 very prestigious cable channels that are gonna uh, broadcast it at the same time. And that's a good look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's dope, dope. I was, you know, just honored to be a part of it. Yeah, and Dr. Dre just released this uh, record. Yeah. Back to business on the pharmacy, featuring right yourself. Right. So how did you end up getting on there? Man, to be honest with you, man, I had worked with Dre, man, for on a few records, man. Mm -hmm. Not just that one. We did like. Maybe five, six, or more records. And, right. You know, when you do records with Dre, he put them out when he want to put them out. Mm -hmm. uh, he just, I guess, he just felt, you know, that was, you know, was the right time to put that one out. And, exactly. You know, he has my, you know, my 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 ultimate blessing. So, is there more Dre and Tip? Absolutely. Records in the stairs. Absolutely. Dime trap coming soon. <laughs> All right. And then speaking of the dime trap, uh -huh. you posted a picture with Jay Z, alluding to a feature that's going to be on there. Did I allude to a feature? I mean, look, you said it's Three Kings. I mean, the picture tells a lot, though. I said it was Three Kings in the picture, but did I say anything about a song? I, so you, so is I it going to be that song on there, or you just not trying to say there's going to be a song I'm on there? I'm not going to confirm nor deny anything. I think that you should, you know, go get the dime trap, and, you know, and I think you'll be able to answer that question between now and the release of the dime trap. So that's say. something, everybody, I'm, including myself, we just going to wait on that one. You just going to wait on that one. All right, cool. Can we expect another Hustle Gang mixtape? Sure. Yeah, yeah, sure. You got your eyes on any new artists to add to the crew? Mm, yeah, I actually do. People that we should know about or well, just don't want to speak on that right now? should. Okay, so who? Well... <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm joking, man. I, I can't. I, I don't want to say. You right, know, right, right. You know, until the ink dries and until we actually have agreements Sign in place. That you know what I'm saying? You know, all I would be doing is creating more competition for myself. Exactly. And that wouldn't be smart. Right. So look. So before we go, Travis Scott, he had a good year last year. Absolutely. Rodeo was phenomenal. Like one of the best projects to the me. Best. And of course, you the was best. on there. Yeah. Being talking, narrating. So how did that come about? That was dope. Thank that was you. that was pretty dope. So how did that come about? Did Travis call you on that, or did you volunteer, or how did that go down? I I believe 
it was a culmination of the two. I think we were just kind of like in the studio doing what creative people do, do in the studio to elevate themselves right. and you know and e- evolve and e- evolve their ideas uh, and. You know, we just kind of came up with it. We just put it together. And then, you know, it was just like an idea, like, you know, it would be dope if, and then it just kind of went from there. And it just happened. Yeah, and we were fortunate enough to, you know, bang it out and get it done, man. But I'm just honored to be a part of, to be a part of Travis's career. Yeah. I mean, he's extremely talented, a visionary. I think he is changing the way people make music and the way people listen to music. And I think he's probably one of the most innovative, groundbreaking uh, debut artist that the game has seen in quite some time, so you know I'm I couldn't be more proud of him. Right, I feel the same way. So before we go, let everybody know where they can catch you at on all your social media. Ah man, uh, Trouble Man Thirty One at uh, Instagram and at TIP on Twitter, and I think that's all. That's all I got. Yeah, that's yeah, it. That's all I got, man. I ain't Snapchatting right now. Yeah, you know? that's something that you got to work on. You, man, Snapchat really, is that new wave, though. Well, you know what, bro? <laughs> I'm cool, man. You know, I just feel like. I don't really want that much of what I do every day out there like that. Right, so people you know, don't know. I'd be one of those guys, I'd probably snap. My story would be very short. Boom. Mm-hmm. All right. And, you know, we move on until maybe next week or so. I just don't want I don't want to give people that much access. Because yeah, you do got people that I mean, Snapchat already, everything. But though, what like, I'm saying is, like, you're already on TV. You got me in my house. That's true. On VH1 from Family Hustle. That's true. You know, you're all in my in, in, in my business as far as I, as much as I share with you and my albums and... You know, I, I share with you the pictures and the things that I do with Instagram and I update you with the goings on and Twitter. How much access do you need, <laughs> sir? I mean, I think enough is enough. Hey, that sounds like a satisfying answer to me. <laughs> but you know what? Maybe, you know, I can do what I can to help, you know, provide a social media platform so, you know, you could come and to my platform right. instead of Snapchat. Oh yeah. Instead of Instagram. Or in addition to, who knows? Wevos is already out as a matter of fact. So maybe you should go check out Wevos. That's a new wave. And that's a wrap. It's your boy Baker. Yeah. Alongside Tim. Make sure y'all be on the lookout for the dime trap that's coming out sometime this year. Ten. This year. The tenth Sheesh. album, man. Damn. The tenth album. Time and yeah. flies when you're getting money. Man, Thank what? God. That's a that's a long time running, man. Isn't it now? That's hmm. how you do it though. Love. And we out.